Hey everybody, welcome back to the Frugal Filmmaker Tip of the Month, and today I want to talk about the free screen capture utility built right into Windows called Snipping Tool. Now this is not to be confused with a screen recorder, which I talked about in the past, like open broadcaster software. This is just static captures of your screen. I'm going to show you how to use it. I use this all the time for my Q&A show when you see those lower third emails or YouTube comments or Twitter messages in the bottom of the screen. Here's how you do it. You go to your search box in Windows right here and you search for the word snip. Snipping tool will then come up. You click on it. You get this simple little box like so. And when you click on this little drop down arrow right here, you have your options. The first one that I might use is full screen snip and that captures the entire screen. Uh, you can then save it anywhere by clicking on this d floppy disk icon right here. Often I will add digital animation to these full screen snips, commonly called the Ken Burns effect, which I've also made a video about in the past. But the more common use of this for me anyway, for my Q&A show, is to use the rectangular snip. And what that does is it gives you a little crosshair which you can then drag around whatever it is you want to capture which you can basically crop the screen, let go of your mouse, and then you can save it just like you could the full screen snip by clicking on the floppy disk icon. And that's pretty much it. This is a very simple tool. I really like it because it's very effective and it's built right into Windows. You don't have to download anything, so it's free. It's really awesome. I recommend you use it, pin it to your taskbar. And this has been the Frugal Filmmaker Tip of the Month.